pom pom. <laughs> we just love the jingle. We, we really do. It, it, still it gets get stuck old. in your head. I know. And, in, and as we head into December, it's like even more fun. Sure. By the way, Christmas Sarah is, <laughs> is here. It really? It's very exciting. Yeah. <laughs> hey, are you feeling a little tired this morning? <gasps> if so, you're not alone. In fact, about 22% of people admit to dozing off while they're on the clock. <gasps> not good. Even though I have definitely seen people here sleep on that couch over there on oh, the yeah. Charlotte Today set. It's honestly, though, embraced. It is, actually. Like, like I think yeah. because we all have wacky hours. And so, I mean, I don't even think it's frowned upon. You're sometimes told, go, go take a sleep yeah, yeah. on the Charlotte Today mm -hmm. couch and you'll be better. Have you yeah. seen somebody sleep on it lately? I haven't seen that. No, because we not received lately. an email not to do it. Oh, oh yes. we did? Yes. yes. Oh, yeah. I mean, I have it. <laughs> I actually, when I, I would work the weekend, sometimes I'd work overnight. Uh, I've slept. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. um, so anyway, so this morning we are asking you, what is the strangest place that you've fallen asleep? Okay. So a new poll out of London found that 12% of people have gotten a little shut-eye while at a bar or a club. Ooh. Ooh. It's called passing out. I know. Yeah, I I know. That, that's what I'm saying. I'm I like, think th there's sleeping. a difference here. I, I, I think you oh, just went to sleep. I think you you've been overserved. <laughs> yeah. 10% um, uh, of folks say they've taken a nap while on the toilet. That, now, that doesn't make sense to me. Are you at the bar or the club, too? That, no, afterwards. Yeah, I that that just kind of thing toilet. just stinks. Come on, yeah. man. <laughs> there you go. Um, so we <laughs> want to know this morning, where is the strangest place you've fallen asleep and These we asked folks this morning during the show on air and, and we got all sorts of uh, i was surprised that we got such creative different responses casino floor Ooh. my wedding traffic light <laughs> traffic light that's Whoa. not good that's, that's oh, that's safety that's hazard yeah. um i fell asleep at a tennessee football game with 102,000 screaming fans that person wow. goes on to that's say over -served. i had too many margaritas yes. i think yes. distinction here uh, my dad fell asleep while cutting the grass on my riding mower, woke up after he uh, broke I mean, the I mean, hose. He wow. Right I would there. never fall asleep watching you wake up Charlotte. I would miss you too much. I don't hey. know who you are, but hey. You're, hey. you are clearly a person of refined Thank taste. Yes. Thank you. Uh, someone else said they have narcolepsy, so they fall asleep everywhere, and they actually use their Apple Watch. Mm. To help track well, their uh, that's understandable. Oh, that, REM sleep. That's awesome. That the, not so, for the, but so, the, so chime in it. below. Let us know. Um, and uh, Larry, we'll begin with you. Well, okay. I mean, I what mean, is the, the strangest place? The, the, not that it's strange, but I mean, I, I actually many times here can do this thing where it's almost like you're asleep but you're awake. <laughs> Yeah, uh, it's amazing. It's, so over yeah. there at your computer, of you're... course, yes. But when I was in college, uh, strangest place. No, uh, if it's falling asleep. It's not passing yes. out. No, we're gonna call it no, falling no, asleep. No, I, I was actually camping out, camping out with, but with just on the beach. Uh, and I think it was uh, near Salter Path, North Carolina, near Morehead City. Mm -hmm. Yeah. In college, uh, I woke up. I was on the beach laying down, and the tide coming in, lifting me up. Wow. No yeah. way. Yeah. Whoa. Well, I was we telling... We partying the night before. The, well, of no, course. No, we were camping out. Yes, yeah. camping out. Yeah. I, I was telling Ben on this shift, which I have done mornings a lot in yeah. my career, and um, when I was younger and I lived in Connecticut, I would take the train down to visit friends in New York, and I would try to go out with them, but I had been on this shift where yeah. I got up at one in the morning, and I would fall asleep, nothing to drink. I would just be yeah. like waiting. We were waiting to go in somewhere. I'd fall asleep. I'd fall asleep at a restaurant. And yeah. my friend's yeah. friends would be like, is your friend okay? Like they were oh, yeah. so, or strangers. Oh, is this, is she okay? Oh yeah, we're watching her. She's just napping before we're going into this show or whatever, because I just, I couldn't stay awake. With these hours, it's, <laughs> it's exhaustion. I yeah. mean, yeah. the shift is yeah. exhausting. Yeah, what about you, Ben? Uh, I've definitely slept here a few times. Uh -huh. um, Again, not like hiding, but like working it overnight or storm yeah. coverage or something mm -hmm. like that. Definitely slept here a few times. I can't think of a crazy place, and I know I'm forgetting something, especially being on this shift. You Your mom probably asleep. has stories. Yeah, or, <laughs> yeah, or Brad probably tells that. Last week I slept in an airport for several hours, um, which I don't think that's all that strange. But, not great for the neck. Um, yeah. No, it wasn't the most comfortable, but again, we were traveling and you had to yeah. do it. So ask for a blanket and just 
and just cuddled up and just right, Chris, wing it right, right there in lounge. Okay, so I went to school at Florida State, and when I graduated, I did the long drive back to Massachusetts, so my car was crammed. Ooh, uh, but uh, on the drive, I got to South Carolina, I was like, I'm way too tired. So I couldn't really sleep in my car, so I decided to lay down on top of a picnic table. and I woke Outside? Outside. And then I woke up. And you didn't to, get mugged. To a kid uh, saying, Mom, Mom, is that a homeless person? <gasps> so then I, I woke up, and I just kind of sauntered back to my car. But no, I laid right on the picnic table. Because my, my little teeny Acura. Why does this not surprise me? Why did you not get a hotel? I was a college student. <laughs> yeah. I can't afford that. You've never yeah. slept on a picnic table? Yeah. No. Oh, and so this wasn't at night. This was like at so. like 10 o'clock in the morning. Yeah. So Making it a little more strange. It makes it a little stranger. That's yeah, why. Yeah. I'll tell you like a strange place. I thought this happened more than once. In a dental chair. I need better stories. A dental chair? A somebody dental actually, chair somebody, son, somebody said that this morning. My dentist going, Larry, open your mouth. Come on. I'm going to fall asleep. I'm just laid uh, down and asleep just like I've, I've fallen asleep getting my hair cut. I do. Yeah, I, uh, that is hard. There we go. There that we go. Is, one. Especially yep, at half. I tell you when it happens. It's not during the haircut, but when they wash your hair. Uh, and you're oh, yeah. Back, and they start massaging mm -hmm. yeah. your scalp. Forget oh, it. I, I, I've fallen asleep there <laughs> several yes. times. I've told my hairdresser, you know, because this isn't my natural color. What? Um, but anyway, it's your natural hair. Yes, it is. Yeah. Um, but when they're coloring your hair, it takes forever, and it's always like after work, and you're tired. I said something needs to be invented just to hold your neck up. You can just sleep, yeah. and then they can color well, your what, hair. That's why you do this. Uh, no, in a chair. It oh, needs to okay, come up okay. from okay. your. You get one of those like uh, airplane chair. pillows, you know, like those those travel <laughs> yeah. pillows that you wrap no, around. Oh yeah, that's true. But it can't be where you bob and you mess up the color. Um, okay, Melissa's saying I was just at a resort in the Dominican Republic. Sounds nice, mm -hmm. and I fell asleep sitting up watching live music and a dance show. Travel will do it to you. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Travel will. Just relax. Uh, yeah. My friends have picture proof. Okay, Melissa, put that picture uh, yeah. in the comments. Mm -hmm. we, yeah, we want to see come it. Come on, come on. Joy saying, I've fallen asleep watching Harry Potter in the movie theater. It's a long movie. I, well, I will say the way they do movie theaters now with the reclining chairs oh, yeah. and, and like... Yeah. Do they want you to fall asleep? It's like yeah, a little bit too relaxing. If it's not an action flick and there's yeah. a slow, uh -huh. slow part of the movie. And you're like, oh, this is so comfortable. And, Let me recline it back. And what's that movie theater? It's off Independence where they pretty much they give you like a little couch seat. It is so comfortable. I think it's off of Sardis Road. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's yeah. like, Sardis, it's Sardis. yeah, it's yeah. oh, my goodness. Yeah. Now I've almost mm. fallen asleep yeah. there as well. All right. All right. Chime I, in. Let us know yeah. the strangest place you've fallen asleep. What, what was the strangest that we heard? Maybe the lawnmower. The, the lawnmower, lawnmower was, was pretty. That was, that was, yeah. The toilet. Pretty. Casino uh, floor. Casino. That's passing out. Yeah. A UT yeah. football game. Yeah, that. I, having been to one of those, that's loud. I don't yeah. know how you do that. But anyway, table. we were. Yeah. We were. We were amused. Table. We were amused by your answers. All right. We'll see you back here tomorrow. Have a good Bye, one, folks. Everybody.